Welcome to Align with Dominique. Today's practice will be a quick and energizing yoga flow for those days where you are super busy and don't have much time, but you would like to get a flow in. We will get started right away from a standing position at the top third of our mat. Feet will firmly plant onto the mat, arms alongside the body. Integrity through the spine, chin parallel to the earth. We'll take a big inhale through the nose. Open mouth, sigh, release. One more time, just like that. Inhale through the nose. Open mouth, sigh, let that go. Seal the lips, ujjayi breath, restriction of the back of the throat. Inhale, arms sweep up towards the ceiling, gaze goes up. Exhale, prayer fold, hinge at the hips. Inhale, halfway lift here. Exhale, release. Start to pedal the knees left and right, energizing through the back of the legs, at the same time finding length. We have a few more pedals here. Then take one more in each direction. Find stillness in your forward fold. Drop the crown of the head to the mat. Then allow the hands to plant as you step one foot back and then the other for a plank pose. Then knees, chin, chest, slither through for a high cobra. Tuck the toes, lift the hips, down dog. Take a moment in your down dog to pedal through the feet. A little bit of a different sensation than we just had in our forward fold. Then eventually you'll find stillness, lift the heels, bend the knees, gaze forward, exhale, top of mat, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift, hands to shins, exhale, release and fold. Bend through the knees, inhale, gather energy, come all the way up, exhale, prayer hands to chest. Inhale, arms sweep up towards the ceiling, stay upright. On your exhale, left arm in front, right arm behind, standing T twist, hips stay framing front of mat. Inhale, arms overhead. Exhale, other side. Inhale, arms overhead. Exhale, bend through the elbows, open up the chest, gaze goes up. Inhale, arms overhead, stay upright. Exhale, hands interlace, low back. Bend through the knees, roll shoulders up towards the ears as you inhale. Exhale, hinge and fold at the hips. We'll find that pedal left and right again, this time with the bind of the hands behind the back. Take a moment here as you sway left and right. Mind muscle connection to the shoulders and the backs of the legs. Then we have one more pedal in each direction. Then find stillness here. Inhale, halfway lift, hand pack, it comes to low back. Exhale, release to the earth. Inhale, step back for a plank pose. This time your choice of knees, chin, chest, or chaturanga. Inhale for high cobra or up dog. Exhale, press back, down dog. Inhale, lift right foot up towards the ceiling. Exhale, right knee to nose. Step it through, low crescent lunge. Take your time as you settle in, arms overhead. We breathe here in low crescent. Allow left hip to open up. Then lower left hand alongside left leg. Right hand comes to left ear and drop your right ear towards right shoulder. Find a stretch through the left side of the neck. Eyes can be closed or gaze can be out of upper left hand corner of the eye. We breathe here two more breaths. Then release the grip of the hand. Inhale both arms overhead. Exhale arms out to a T. Inhale here. On your exhale find an eagle wrap right arm underneath the left. Find space between the shoulder blades and breathe. Lift the elbows in line with the shoulders. Last round of breath with this eagle wrap. 
Then release the arms overhead, inhale. Exhale, rock back for a half split, straighten your front leg. And you can rock the hips left and right as the back of right leg opens up. The more flexion you have through your right foot, the more of a stretch you will feel behind your right leg. And it doesn't matter if you round or straighten your back here, the more that you flatten your back, the greater intensity you'll feel through the back of your right leg. Then begin to shift forward, bend through right knee, tuck left toes, lift left knee. Right foot steps back to meet the left, plank pose. Your choice of knees, chin, chest, or chaturanga. Inhale for high cobra or up dog. Exhale, press back, down dog. Three rounds of breath. You can pedal through the feet or stay in stillness. Inhale, lift left foot up towards the ceiling. Exhale, left knee to nose, step it through, low crescent lunge. Untuck right toes, arms overhead. Take a moment here as you allow your right hip to open. Perhaps there's a stretch through right quad. Then right hand releases alongside right leg. Left hand over towards right ear, drop left ear towards left shoulder. Again, eyes can be closed or gaze can be out of the corners of the eyes. One more full round of breath here. Then release the grip, both arms alongside the body. Inhale, arms sweep up. Exhale, arms out to a T. This time we find the eagle wrap. Left arm underneath the right. Lift the elbows in line with the shoulders. Breathe here. Allow the shoulder blades to separate. One more full round of breath. Then release the hands, arms overhead, inhale. Exhale, rock back, half split. You can rock the hips left and right or stay still. The more flexion you find through left foot, the greater intensity of the stretch behind left leg. Again, your choice, if you wanna flatten through the back or round, depends on how much intensity you would like here. Last round of breath. Then bend through left knee, shift forward, tuck right toes, lift right knee. Step left foot back to meet the right, plank pose. Your choice, knees, chin, chest, or chaturanga. Inhale for high cobra or up dog. Exhale, press back, down dog. We won't stay in down dog that long this time, so inhale, lift your heels, bend the knees, gaze forward. Exhale, top of mat, forward fold. Inhale for chair pose, glutes sit back, arms overhead, breathe here. Weight shifts into the heels. Then lift the heels off the earth so the weight shifts into the balls of the feet. Start to bend through the knees, pray your hands to chest, find a toe stand. One more full round of breath here. Then slowly make your way onto the earth. Glutes are on the mat, knees are bent, feet are planted. Then lift the balls of the feet so only the heels are on the earth and find a seated rabbit. You can grab for the ankles, blades of the feet, or just rest the arms on the mat. Then tuck chin to chest, forehead to the knees. Continue to breathe here. Two more full rounds of breath. Then slowly begin to release yourself up. Feet come onto the earth, extend left leg out, bend at right knee, right foot comes inside of left leg. 
shift so that your shoulders are framing over your hips, which is gonna be towards right corner of the mat. Inhale, arms up towards the ceiling. On your exhale, twist towards the left. Big inhale here, find length through the spine. Exhale, hinge at the hips, fold over left leg. We only have three rounds of breath here. Allow low back to open. Last one. Then begin to crawl yourself up. Left inner foot comes in to meet the right. Shift so that the hips and shoulders face towards the front of the mat and then start to fold over the inner thighs with this butterfly shape. Crown of head drops towards the earth. Begin to walk yourself up. This time right leg extends out, left foot inside of right leg. Inhale, lift the arms overhead. Exhale, twist, so shoulders frame right leg. Inhale here, length through the spine. Exhale, hinge and fold over right leg. We only have three rounds of breath here. Begin to walk yourself up. You'll find a simple crisscross of the legs, doesn't matter which is in front. Inhale, arms sweep up towards the ceiling. Exhale, twist towards the right, right hand behind the body. Left hand to right knee, gaze beyond right shoulder. One more breath. Then release the twist, inhale, arms sweep up. We move to the other side. Left hand behind, right hand to left knee, gaze beyond left shoulder. Then slowly bring yourself back to center, left hand to the heart, right hand to the earth. Take a moment, you can close your eyes and bow your head. Gratitude to yourself for taking a few moments for yourself to check in with the body and the breath. It's always a pleasure to guide you and I'll see you next time. Namaste.